everybody, Jason here of GhostbustersNews.com, and as always, Ghostbusters News right here on YouTube. And today, we've booted up the PlayStation-exclusive video game, Dreams. Now, we've talked about this game several times here on the channel, and I feel that this game is certainly worth your time, as it allows players to make their very own video game. And as I'm showing you right here, you can do some pretty remarkable things, such as making your own action platformer, your own racing game, and third-person shooters. More importantly, Ghostbusters-themed third-person shooters. Now, the game you're taking a look at right here was made by Ghostbusters fan Ryan Ward. And in the past, we actually featured a full playthrough of this game here on the Ghostbusters News YouTube channel. If you'd like to check that out, be sure to click the link down below in this video's description. But since we made that video, Ryan has actually upgraded and revamped this game just a little bit, including new areas and better gameplay when it comes to the Mini Puffs Toastathon minigame, as well a brand new edition called Mini Busters. Now, first up, we're going to show you this Mini Puffs Toastathon, which kind of plays like Call of Duty Zombies, as you have to survive endless waves of Mini Puffs. Now, you play as Slimer with a Ghost Popper in hand. Yes, a real Ghostbusters Kenner Ghost Popper. How cool is that? And there's three levels you can play in, one that looks like a store, one that is a bedroom, as you can see here, and this comes complete with a real Ghostbusters Kenner Firehouse in the middle of the room, as well there's an additional level called the Doomsday Door that comes directly from the real Ghostbusters episode. Now I'm going to show you a quick snippet of gameplay here, and then I'll be back to talk a little more to you. Seems like fun, right? Well, in addition to the Mini Puffs Toastathon, Ryan Ward has also added a brand new mini game called Mini Busters, which has you playing as two Mini Puffs, one with a PKE meter and another with a ghost trap. And your job here is real simple. You detect ghosts with the PKE meter, and then you trap them with the ghost trap, trying to see how many ghosts you can trap within the span of two minutes. Once again, here's some gameplay. Now, as I said before, all this is playable in the PlayStation exclusive game, Dreams. In addition to what we've shown you today, there is some additional Ghostbusters content available within the game, including this Ghostbusters game, once again made by Ryan Ward. And I gotta say, the voice actor sounds pretty familiar. A ghost? Someone better call the... Oh, wait a minute. That's me. Right. As well, there's a much darker and jump-scare Ghostbusters game made by a different user which, once again, we've taken a look at here in the past on Ghostbusters News. It's after me. There has to be a way out. Right? If you'd like to check out those videos, once again, links are down below in this video's description. Now, that's all I've got for you here right now. As always, be sure to subscribe to Ghostbusters News here on YouTube. Bust that bell notification icon to stay up to date with everything that's happening within the Ghostbusters world. If you'd like to join up with Ghostbusters News, check out our Patreon page. We have a link to that down below in this video's description. And I'll see everybody right back here next time.